Hi, and welcome to WordLive. Colonel Gaddafi has telephoned a TV station in Syria, rejecting claims that he has done a runner to Niger. He said in a call that he was still in Libya and called on his people to continue to fight against the rebels and NATO. The call from North Africa didn't include any requests for bank account details in order to deposit a large sum of money for safekeeping. Perhaps the only time in recent history such a request would have been legitimate. Oh, sorry, the call was not from Niger, but from well inside the Libyan borders. Sure. Despite our ongoing prayers, there hasn't been a miracle overnight. The world economies are still struggling, affecting stocks, shares, savings and people's livelihoods around the globe. It is enough to think that the problem may in fact be caused by our own actions and we need to have a different view on wealth, health and happiness. Perhaps we have let our own greed push us down the path we're treading. We should continue to pray, but let our prayer shape our actions too. In today's Word Live, Jesus is suggesting that we do know what the right thing to do is, but time and again we don't act on what we know. Let's be changed, and let's make a difference. I'll see you soon. Bye.